Okay, so Spud and I are going to, um, well, we're going on our adventure right now. And the thing is, is I realized that, like, while I care about what you think, um, at the same time, I don't like hearing it constantly, the same thing over and over and over and over again, okay? Because I already do that to myself, and then when you do it to me, it's just kind of like, <laughs> no, we gotta stop this, okay? Close it. So then it's just like, ugh, okay. But the thing is, is that, like, yeah, okay, I didn't want to have my name out there anymore because I overspoke many a times and then I overreacted many times but the thing was is I thought that you guys were going under okay and so I was like yo we gotta save these folks we gotta save these folks so I did everything I could put myself on the line for it and then now I'm putting myself on the line for it again by doing whatever it is that I do in my reality but like whenever I video and stuff so I'm just like oh boy here we go but I just leveled up but now I'm back out in the world because Liam would not stop like like ugh, he just kept on crying and I was just like why are you crying so much like just chill and then he we took a shower as the previous video shows or suggests and then now we are back on the road again so So, oh, did I bring my wallet this time around? Yeah, it's right there. Okay. So, basically, because each person in my life and, like, the key people or whatever in my life, like, they all have these different, like, rules. And I'm talking about, like, authority figures, like, my mom, my dad, my grandparents, like, the doctors, the, the law, the, I don't really, well, okay, the thing is, is, like, as much as I care about the law and the doctors, like, I really do I have to for Liam's sake, but, like, for my sake, I'm not really feeling it anymore, bro. Like, I gotta be the doctor. I ain't trying to be no patient. Like, I don't understand what you guys are thinking here, but, yeah. So then, now we're back on here, and, yeah. So, the thing is, is that, like, I'm very concerned about, like, my mother and how she thinks and how she feels. And with my father, I'm more concerned about what he sees and how he perceives. So um, I'm going to have to knock that out because I'm not feeling that. Like, I really don't want to be dealing with that because, like, not, like, I have my own worries and concerns. And, yeah, I'm worried and concerned at the same time. But at the same time, I know what I'm doing. You just got to give me a minute to be here, like alone like I, I gotta be here by myself okay because this is as nice as like the whole family communal like thing is like it's a little bit too much for me you know and then also on top of that like when like just being out here in the real world like it's a bit much like it's all just a bit much like I'm gonna need my space and time like if Jeremy got to go and go run off for a while I should sure be able to go and run off for a while you take care of your kid like what the hell excuse you uh, hello? What, how old is he? Like, I have no idea. So, if it's the 5th or the 11th today, then he is a month and 23 plus 7, 8, 9, 10, 7, and then plus 11, 7, 11, 7, 11, that's 18. So, um, 30, 48, four, wait, yeah, 48 days old. Kid's 48 days old. Um, he, he's pretty, like, this is the most intense thing I've ever seen. And, like, the thing is, is they're like, oh, just be patient with him and just be like, this is a blessing, these are the best moments of your life. Okay, yeah, we're done with the cliches here, guys. Like, I'm, I'm sorry, but, like, yeah, it's great. I love him. It's, it's beautiful. But, like, at the same time, like, stop it. Like, seriously, chill. Because, like, um, <laughs> I'm doing this by myself 24-7, and yes, you babysit for, like, 
three days and you babysit for like you know and it's nice and you've helped and like really brought this together for me but like at the same time um no okay just just I need I think I'm gonna need like a week I'm gonna have to tell them that before they see, well they're probably just gonna see it and I'll just tell them it later but like and that's the thing too like everybody's like people be going to my mom or my dad about different things that I'm doing and being like did you see what Kayla posted I'm just like um hello <laughs> I am an adult, I am a mom, like, you can't just go to my mom for everything, so I think I've been going to my mom for way too much, so I'm trying to, like, back off her, but, like, still let her know that, like, I still, like, mess with her like I used to, but, like, at the same time, it's just a little too much, like, like, I'm gonna need you to chill, like, I got myself this far, like, I, yeah, I thought I was, I thought I was going to you know, many a times before, but now I don't think that's actually happening, and I'm tired of tricking myself into that way, and I'm tired of living under people's thumbs, and they're like, I think it's about, you think it's about control, yeah, I do, because that's, oh, that's pretty, I like that, so we're going over here, but I was just like, yeah, like, <laughs> what, what is this, oh, that's pretty too, okay, and but yeah, and then they're like, well, don't do this, don't do that, because somebody's going to say this or that. Nobody cares about incomplete thoughts, blah, blah, blah. And I just said, um, yeah, okay, I'm not doing this for anybody but myself, because honestly, <laughs> like, this this world is nothing if you're not yourself. So I'm just like, yeah, definitely, this is cute. This is really cool. Uh, love where you live, Green Bay, the art district. Okay, we'll go like this. But, like, honestly, like... Like, I wrote about how I wanted to adopt kids or whatever, and it was, like, incomplete thought. And then they were like, oh, well, why did she write that? B bro, why are you asking about me they wanting to adopt kids when I literally have been posting nonsense this whole time? Like, why did you ask about the nonsense, not the adoption of kids? Like, what? So, hold up. Okay, and apparently after all that's happened, nothing happens anyway unless I, like, restrict myself. But I restricted myself so much that I broke free and then like but now this time shout out to my husband for leaving me <laughs> cause like okay as much as it hurts it actually really worked out for the better on my my end I'm I'm sure it worked out for the better on his end too because I mean we're, we're gonna come back together like he said but we gotta do something first which I feel like is really just a big like it's so serious, but it's also, like, the biggest, like, F you, and it's just, like, um, okay, well, whatever, but, ugh, and the thing is, is that I'm supposed to be, like, oh, I'm not taking him back, you know what, I don't care, you know what, I care as much as I don't care, if something happens, I'll take the action, okay, I'll take the consequences, just, like, what I'm saying and stuff like that, but, like, I really don't need you all up on my junk, like, step back, it's all good, I got the situation handled, so it's kind of, like, that's pretty, too, so, Ugh. But I'm just like, yeah. You know, I'm tired of people being like, oh, well, you're this, you're that. No, I am nothing to you, okay? Absolutely nothing. No, I'm just kidding. But still, it's just like, well, I guess. Oh, that's cool. Okay, but, oh the club? Ew, I've been there. The oval. We should turn around. This is a strip club that we, we went to. It was, or, can you say, yeah, because you could say strip mall as well. So anyways, it was a club that I went to, and it was really strange because it was just really strange because I was just like, oh, what is this about? But then I saw it later and, like, recognized it again. Still don't really understand that, but I am trying to... Uh, I also like that as well. So, yeah, the thing is, is that, like, I'm not really sc as scared as I think I am. It's only when I'm, like, like, when I get tied down, and I got tied down by, like, everybody. So I was just like, um, <laughs> I'm gonna need break free. And, um, I guess that's what this is, but that's pretty too. Okay, so, wow, so many things to look at. Yeah, because, okay, I used to have a dog named Bedby, used to go everywhere with her, and now I have a kid named Liam, and that's just gonna be our vibe, because I can't, like, 
we can't we can't be doing all this okay